Hey guys, welcome to another video by Simply Learn. In this video, we will learn about what is TypeScript. Let's look at what's in it for you in today's session. We'll first start with understanding what is TypeScript, followed by which we will look at why should we use TypeScript. Then we will look at the difference between TypeScript versus JavaScript. Then we will look at some of the important features of TypeScript followed by which we will look at the applications of TypeScript and proceeding further we will look at advantages of using TypeScript and disadvantages of using TypeScript. But before we begin make sure you have subscribed to our YouTube channel and clicked on the bell icon so you never miss an update from Simply Learn. What is TypeScript? TypeScript is object oriented and strongly typed programming language which is superset of JavaScript. TypeScript code is converted to JavaScript, which can be executed anywhere JavaScript is supported in a browser or Node.js and any other application. TypeScript was designed by Anders Hegelsberg at Microsoft. The limitations of JavaScript for the development of large-scale application at the Microsoft and among its external customers led to the creation of TypeScript. Due to the difficulty of working with the complicated JavaScript code, there was demand for custom tooling to make developing JavaScript components easier. TypeScript is JavaScript with some additional features. To support a strong interaction with your editor, TypeScript adds additional syntax to JavaScript. TypeScript is a scripting language that understands JavaScript and uses type inference to provide powerful capabilities without the need for additional code. Why TypeScript? Compilation. JavaScript is an interpreted language. There is no need to compile it. As a result, it must be run to ensure that it is genuine. If there is an error, that implies you write all the code to find out an output. As a result, you will have to spend hours looking for the faults in the code. So, error checking is provided via the TypeScript transpiler. If TypeScript detects any syntax mistakes, it will compile the code and generate compilation errors. This aids in the detection of mistakes prior to the execution of the script. TypeScript provides an optional type system for JavaScript code. When a client doesn't have a value for a parameter, he can pass a null. Optional arguments are features of TypeScript. We can declare some arguments in the function optional by utilizing optional parameter features so that the client is not necessary to supply a value to optional parameters. Strong Static Typing JavaScript does not have a powerful static typing system. Thus, the TLS TypeScript comes with an optional static typing and type inference system. The TLS, that is a TypeScript language service, can deduce the type of variable defined with no type based on its value. Supports object-oriented programming such as classes, interfaces, inheritance and other object-oriented programming principles are supported by TypeScript. TypeScript supports type definitions. Existing JavaScript libraries can use TypeScript type definitions. External JavaScript libraries are defined in TypeScript definition files. As a result, these libraries can be included in TypeScript code. Now let us look at the difference between TypeScript versus JavaScript. TypeScript is an object-oriented programming language, whereas JavaScript is a scripting language. And TypeScript supports static typing, whereas JavaScript does not support static typing. Errors can be found and corrected during compile time. In JavaScript, errors can be found only during the runtime as it is an interpreted language. There is a concept for ES3, ES4, ES5, and ES6 in TypeScript, whereas no support for compiling additional ES3, ES4, ES5, or ES6 features in JavaScript. Functions can have optional parameters in TypeScript, whereas this feature is not possible in JavaScript. Converted into JavaScript code to be understandable for browsers in TypeScript. In JavaScript, this can directly be used in browsers. In TypeScript, proper build setup is required for static type definitions. No build setup is required in JavaScript. Now let us look at the features of TypeScript. 
TypeScript supports other JavaScript libraries. TypeScript is a new Microsoft language that is highly typed superset of JavaScript with support for object-oriented programming and other current features like decorators. Because browsers and nodes comprehend JavaScript, TypeScript compiles to JavaScript. TypeScript is portable. TypeScript is cross-browser, cross-device and cross-platform. It can run in any environment that supports JavaScript. TypeScript, unlike its competitors, does not require dedicated virtual machine or a specific runtime environment to run. TypeScript is superset of JavaScript. It's a strong syntactical superset of JavaScript with the addition of optional static typing. TypeScript is a large-scale application development language that transcompiles to JavaScript. TypeScript is static and TypeScript is object-oriented language. When a client doesn't have a value for a parameter, he can pass null. Optional arguments are a feature of TypeScript. We when it comes to object-oriented programming with JavaScript, JavaScript shines because of the class keyword. It makes object-oriented programming look quite similar to programming in other object-oriented languages like C Sharp or Java. Applications of TypeScript TypeScript can be used to develop JavaScript applications for both client-side and server-side execution. TypeScript can be deployed instead of JavaScript language since it adds more features and gives error directly with the code. TypeScript is used for building large-scale applications for enterprises. Advantages of TypeScript Highlights error at the compilation time during the time of development. In TypeScript, it runs on any browser or JavaScript engine. TypeScript has a namespace concept by defining a module. TypeScript supports strongly typed or static typing. Disadvantages of TypeScript TypeScript takes a long time to compile the code. TypeScript does not support abstract classes. TypeScript has extra compilation step for converting TypeScript into JavaScript. TypeScript has an overly complicated typing system. So with that, we have reached the end of this video. I hope you liked the video. Thank you for watching. Keep learning and stay tuned to Simply Learn. Hi there. If you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.